There are new revelations on how the couple wanted in connection to a murder here in Tucson escaped. Investigators now saying Blaine and Susan Barksdale faked an emergency, overpowered two guards, tied them up, and then got away. Wanted for murder. Husband and wife on the run after overpowering the security guards transporting them across the country. Authorities say Blaine Barksdale, who has ties to the Aryan Brotherhood, and his wife Susan pretended to have some kind of medical emergency, forcing their guards to pull over. We believe that so they used some kind of a medical emergency or a medical bathroom break for them to pull over to the side of the road. And once they got over to the side of the road, they were able to overpower them, uh, bind them, and uh, threw them in the back of the van they were in. The Barksdales are suspected in the April murder of 72-year-old Frank Bly of Tucson. His home burned, but his body never found. Bly's brother telling CNN Frank had a relationship with the Barksdales, especially the wife. Sue and my brother were, were very good friends. And it was just a, uh, you know, they were just, a, it was a good friendship relationship. Police haven't commented on the motive, but the Barksdales also face robbery charges. William Bly stunned that the couple was able to get away. We thought everything was going to be fine. You know, we actually thought that the, this week they were going to be in Arizona and they were going to start all the court processing and everything like that. And now everything is just up in the air. They don't know what's going to happen right now. In May, police arrested the couple in upstate New York. This week, the cross-country extradition. The couple making their escape, attacking the guards on Monday in southern Utah. It took a few hours for the guards to break out of the van where they were able to notify the local sheriff's uh, department. So what kind of uh, concerns me at this point is that they need money and uh, maybe another vehicle. That desperation to remain free is why authorities are now worried about the potential for the couple to commit more violent crimes. Sean Mooney, News 4, Tucson.